Hello Legends, this is Tarpor and I am here to provide a very low effort tutorial. I'm going to show you guys how to download the latest version of um, the proximity chat mod. Uh, so forgive forgive my browser or whatnot, just in your search browser you want to search simple voice chat. And this is the link you want to click on. It says it's a CurseForge link, it says simple voice chat, mods, Minecraft, CurseForge. <laughs> When you click on that, you'll see a description of the basic mod. Forget about that. Um, what you want to do is you want to click on files, or you can click on the recent files on the right, but what you want to do is click on files, and then see where it says Fabric 1.18, Simple Voice Chat 1.18-2.1.17. Go ahead and click download. You want to download that file. Okay, I'm going to put it in my downloads folder. And then the other thing that you want to do is there's a second thing you want to download. But the second thing you want to search up is Fabric API 1.18. Click Fabric API, Mods, Minecraft, Curse Forge. It's on the same website. And then perfect. Right here you see the, the latest Fabric API. Um, it was just uploaded on December 3rd. Go ahead and click Download. Okay, and we'll put that also in our downloads. Perfect. Now, remember not to run either of these. You just want to make sure they're both in your downloads folder. And then the third thing you want to do is download the latest fabric loader. Because right now, most of you guys still have the 1.17 fabric loader. So on fabricmc.net, you'll see this little messy thing. But what do you, what do you want to click on on this website, fabricmc.net, is the little text here that says here. The blue text, it's a link. Okay, now go ahead and click download installer after clicking on the link. So I'm going to use the universal one. And then I already have it downloaded, the fabric installer. Um, so I won't click save. But for you guys that haven't already had it downloaded, go ahead and click that. And now what we want to do is we want to run the fabric loader. So let me open up my downloads folder. And I'll put these on the desktop just to make it easier to see if you'd like when you're doing this you can download it onto the desktop uh, go ahead and click run the fabric installer I'm doing that by double clicking it on my desktop perfect and here we are now what you'll see is the minecraft version and the loader version what you want to do is click 1.18 for the minecraft version you want to be on the latest loader version, which is 12.9 today. And then where it says, just check that create profile box and make sure you're not on this server. Make sure you're on client. You wanna make sure you're on client. And go ahead and click install, boom. And there you are, it will have installed. And now what we want to do is uh, get to our mods folder. An easy way to do that on both Mac and on Windows is to click your Minecraft, is to run your Minecraft launcher. And once you have opened your Minecraft launcher, go ahead and click installations. You should see here fabric loader 1.18. If you haven't, then go ahead and message me and I will help you to make sure that you see fabric loader um, 1.18 among this, among this list. Click installations and then where it says the fabric loader 1.18 or where it says latest release, it, it doesn't matter. But you guys see the little folder here when I hover over any of these installations, it shows a little folder. I'm going to click the little folder here and what it's going to pull up is my .minecraft folder. Okay, uh, this will look a little different when you're on Mac. If you're on Mac, it'll look something like uh, like this, kind of, probably. Um, and then once you go here, go ahead and click on the mod, open the mods folder. I have a few extra mods, forget this, yours will probably be empty or actually more likely you're going to have mods that we installed for 1.17. Delete everything you have in the mods folder here. Now what you do is you drag in the vo fabric API and the voice chat fabric mod into the mods folder. Okay, now you should have the voice chat mod downloaded. 